I am Shana Didit, and I represent the very last of the Beothic, according to records. It's always the right time to tell these stories. The question is when are Canadians ready to listen? I, I think it's really important that women, uh, Indigenous women, tell the story of Indigenous women as well. Shona Dita is a really important piece because of that, because it allows, it's bringing so many different Indigenous people together. When I think about interdisciplinary work, I think this is the way that it should get made. Like everyone should be in the room, everyone should be inspired by everyone else. I think you make more cohesive choices when you get to work with the people that are going to be a part of something from the beginning. There have been certain people in the past and actually in the present who have who are not indigenous and who feel that they have a right or an interest or both to tell our stories on behalf of us but there is a movement afoot that is allowing indigenous voice to come forward and indigenous storytellers to be part of that storytelling and there are enough of us that we have enough strength to say okay it's our turn if we're going to be involved in these projects we want to tell them our way she sings in the opera about how, you know, how do I sing to descendants that I will not have? Well, we're her descendants, the indigenous artists of this country who know the story, who are looking at her work and then interpreting it. That's, we're her artistic descendants.